Okay, awesome news, and you definitely heard it here first. We knew that with the Nissan uh, i40, that you can have high-speed sync with your Fuji X-T1 and X-T10, but they were limited on a mechanical shutter at 4,000th of a second. We have 8,000th of a second mechanical shutter on the Fuji X-Pro2, and burst flash photography and high-speed sync photography, and they did a... Uh, Three shot burst here, one eight thousandth of a second, F2, flash did fire, of course. Another flash shot, one eight thousandth of a second. So, with the Fuji X Pro 2, you have to use a Canon ITTL cable. By the way, this is a Velo. This is the TTL cable that I recommend because most of the Canon cables, including the actual factory Canon TTL cable, is way too damn short. This is the Velo OCS uh, C6. O CS-C6 and that's with uh, this is an expensive little flash by the way it's a Nissan i40 and it has a little magic mode if you buy it you'll have to put it in when you get it the test button here you'll have to hold it down for three seconds and then this light will start to blink and that means it is in magic mode basically what that means is that this flash is firing the same way that Nikon's uh, auto FP flash fires it actually fires very very rapidly faster than your eye can see like brrr, or bzz, and uh, this weight is covering the entire uh, shutter um, opening and closing at uh, one eight thousandth of a second so this is amazing good news if you want to be shooting in bright daylight and uh, other things at uh, higher shutter speeds at uh, wide open apertures, especially for outdoor portraiture, say I stick a Zeiss, I don't know, f1.4 lens or something in front of this, I can actually shoot with uh, sunlight in the background, open up my aperture to f1.4, f1.8, and then crank up my shutter speed. So that is really awesome news. The proof is in the pudding, and it's right there, one eight thousandth of a second. So you heard it here first, and yes, baby, it works. Like I said, this is the cable that I recommend. The only issue that it has is actually it comes out the front, but I velcroed it here, so it comes out the sides. If it comes out the front, it'll actually drape in front of the lens. And TTL cable manufacturers should stop doing that. It's really a price consideration. They should come out to the side like Nikon's current speed light cables, but this is a Canon TTL pin out, okay? Well, this is a Fuji TTL speed light. Uh, Fuji's pin out on their hot shoe uses a Canon pin out, so this is a Canon TTL cable, and this is a Fuji TTL uh, speed light, the Nissan i40. Thanks for watching. You saw it here first, and yes, high speed sync is absolutely works perfectly on the Fuji X Pro 2 at one eight thousandth of a second, no less. If you like this video and drop me a buck or two, tell me to jump off a cliff, whatever makes you happy. Just want to report the information to you. And thanks for watching. Okay, bye.